Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. We've got an email question here, a question on the email from Meher. Hope I'm saying that right. Hi Matt, I'm Meher from India. I must say I love your work and would, lo- uh, would like to thank you for all your informative videos on photography. Currently I have a Canon 1300D, which is the T6 in our part of the world, uh, body, a Sigma 17-50 f2.8 lens, which I bought on your recommendation, a Canon 50 f1.8 lens, and the Canon 55-250mm to 250 lens. The problem is that the camera doesn't seem to focus accurately at wide apertures when using the viewfinder. I've observed this with both the Sigma and the Canon Prime lens, but the images come out sharp when using live view. So what would you suggest in such a scenario, considering the fact that the body doesn't support micro autofocus adjustment? Thank you. Regards, Maher. Well, Thanks for your question, and it's an interesting question because um, there's some you do have some options, but it is kind of limited because, like you said, you can't do micro autofocus adjustment on that body. So, because you're saying that the Canon prime lens is having the same issues, I don't think it's a Sigma versus Canon issue. In other words, I don't think it's a miscommunication between a non-OEM lens working on your Canon body. I think it's probably your autofocus system is out of adjustment on the camera. Uh, so if possible, you could get it to a service center and see about having them tweak it and adjust it and see if they can dial in that autofocus for you. Perhaps, depending on how old it is, maybe you can get it service from Canon under warranty because I think that would definitely be something Canon should look at for you under warranty. If that's not an option, then obviously what you're doing at the moment is an option, and that's using live view to make sure you're you're always getting tack sharp focus that can be a pain in the butt i realize that and there's a lot of times you don't want to be using live view it's a slower means of focusing than using um, you know normal autofocus Um, but it is an option in the situations where you can do it and the other one is is to consider selling the body or trading it in and getting into something that does have the micro autofocus adjustment so um, whether you want to step into something like an ADD whether you want to, um, you know, just try a different body. You know, that's the other thing. How long ago did you buy this this camera? If it's fairly new, um, maybe you could exchange it. So uh, those would be your options. I, I would, you know, if you can't exchange it, if it's not new enough to exchange it, um, then I would look at getting it under warranty some, to have the autofocus tuned in to f- or fixed, essentially. If that's not an option, if the warranty's out or whatnot, try and find somebody who services cameras in your area. Should be something that can be fixed, I would think. Um, and if not, you're either stuck, I guess, with shooting in live view to get your uh, shallow depth of field pinpoint autofocus, or you know, getting into a different camera, selling it and uh, liquidating it and getting something else, preferably something that has micro autofocus adjustment. What do you guys think? What do you think is the best solution for Maher? Let me throw it back to you guys. What should he do here? Um, Do you agree with the options I've presented? Is there another option I'm not considering here that he should look at? Let us know in the comments below what you would do, what you would suggest in this situation. Let's help him out. Always great to have your feedback as well uh, to help our viewers when they write in for a question. Thank you for your question, Maher, and stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at ArtOfTheImage.com.